A quick way to populate a brain with existing data is to use one of the many different import options. You can also export simple outlines of brains you have created, and more advanced users can even export an entire brain to JavaScript Object Notation, or JSON. You can access the import options by clicking on File Import. The Import button will also appear when creating a new brain. By default, importing data will create a new brain database. However, if there's a brain open in the background, you'll have the option to import your data into this existing brain. You can import version 8 brains or brain zips, brain 9 archives or BRZ files, properly formatted text outlines, other mind map files, such as Mind Manager and FreeMind, existing folder structures where folders become new thoughts and the files in each folder will be an internal attachment. And finally, properly formatted XML. If the XML import interests you, contact support at thebrain.com for further documentation and helpful formatting guidelines. For this example, I have an outline of a paper that I'm writing for school. I'd like to graphically visualize this document and start making additional connections between people and businesses. In the document I'm about to import, each new line is a thought. I've indented subcategories, which will become child thoughts, with a tab. And notice, on the Steve Jobs entry, I've included the use of a pipe symbol. This will create a thought label with the content that follows. The dash allows me to add a note, the plus sign will attach a URL, and the hash or pound sign will link to another thought already created in this document. It's time to import into a new brain. I now have a new brain called Legendary Entrepreneurs, with over 100 new thoughts thanks to my import. On the thought for Steve Jobs, I can see my thought label, my notes, the web attachment, and links to other existing thoughts. And I can continue adding on to my brain manually from here. I've added some new content into my brain, and I'd like to export the entire thought structure into a text outline for some colleagues to review. I'll open the report and select the option to add all thoughts into my selection box. Now, I can right-click in the selection box and choose Copy as text outline. When I paste into a text editor, such as Word, I have an amazing outline of my entire brain. Finally, more advanced users may be interested in exporting their brains to JSON. To do this, open the desired brain and click on File, Backup to Brain Archive. This will result in the creation of a single BRZ file. It's your entire brain compressed into a single file. Rename the BRZ to .zip. Then extract the zip file. The resulting folder contains JSON files. It's all your data, thoughts, notes, internal attachments, exported from the source brain.